Mike and Tony, the Target 12 investigators continue to track a criminal case against a former state senator. Nicholas Kettle has been indicted in two separate cases on charges including video voyeurism and that he extorted sex from a state house page while he was a lawmaker. And tonight we're learning who may take the stand and testify if the extortion case goes to trial. Target 12 investigator Tim White is here now with his exclusive findings. Court documents in the extortion case against Kettle show two former chiefs of staff for the Senate president are on the witness list, as well as the man who ran the PAGE program at the General Assembly. In February, then State Senator Nicholas Kettle was indicted on two felony counts of extortion and blackmail, accused of extorting sex from a male PAGE who worked in the Rhode Island Senate. It affected someone who was uh, employed in this building as a PAGE, and that's really uh, disconcerting. The case was so shocking, lawmakers were looking to expel the Republican from the General Assembly, but Kettle ended up resigning within a week of his indictment. Court documents reviewed by Target 12 show who prosecutors say is expected to testify in the extortion case. The list includes a state police detective and the former Senate page who police say is the victim. Other names who may take the witness stand, Thomas Coderre, who was Chief of Staff for then Senate President Teresa Piva Weed from 2009 to 2014, and his successor Thomas Papa. As former Chiefs of Staff, Coderre and Papa could talk about how the PAGE program works. Peter Simone is also on the list of potential witnesses. Simone runs the PAGE program. Kettle was also indicted on a separate case, charged with 10 counts of video voyeurism. He's accused of taking illicit pictures of his then-girlfriend, then sharing those photos with a friend. Last week, Kettle's attorney asked that some of those charges be dropped, arguing four of those pictures were allegedly taken out of state. Kettle has pleaded not guilty in both cases on the extortion and blackmail charges. The court document reveals Coderre, Papa, and Simone all testified before the secret grand jury that indicted Kettle. Kettle's attorney was not available for comment. Now, Coderre now works for Governor Gina Raimondo. I reached him by phone. He tells me he was advised by lawyers not to talk about the testimony he gave to the grand jury. With the Target 12 investigators, Tim White, Eyewitness News.